This is the normal attack speed of a Dart Monkey Tower in Bloons TD6. But thanks to Baydock over in the Bloons TD6 modding community, we have changed the attack speed of all towers to a quarter of what they're used to. 25% of the normal attack speed is what all of the towers have. Can we beat Chimps mode with such a crazy restriction in Bloons TD6? Now with something like this, we have to play it on a beginner map. There is no way if I get a tip this on something like Dark Castle and just get wrecked on. And I even brought my girl Sada along. She attacks really fast, but as you can see, even she's affected by this slowdown. Are we gonna even have enough to get through chimps mode? I hope on this map at least, since it spins around so much, this is not gonna be easy. So imagine, you think of towers like the tax zone, it just blows out super quickly, but now it's a quarter of the speed it normally is. Is this gonna even be possible? And chimps mode, we can't farm. So I'm actually very nervous about this. Like right now, is this gonna be enough? I feel like we have to get another dart monkey here just to make sure we're okay. I'm gonna grab one, just because those last two could get through. Okay, he helped, he helped. He helped? Okay, <laughs> you just don't know. Because if there's two in a row, it could be too much. So now for this, we need to hope that he hits the first one and the second one's by Sada. There we go. Now I am gonna throw attack. I really do think that's gonna help a lot and just be kind of like a, uh, a everything eater. And we might actually go with the fire one because then we can get that long range, that extra pierce just to kind of slow everybody down because if anything is there. <laughs> Why is this making me so nervous? Look at this faster shooting. I'm on fast mode and it's going this slow. <laughs> faster shooting is garbage. It's just should be called slower shooting. But with hot shots, I believe we get extra damage in general, right? So we should be able to knock out more balloons. Like those greens should go down to like one shot if nothing. Those yellows are what's gonna be really scary, but we're gonna get long range and super range tax, hoping that will help. But now I think our big major hurdle is gonna be something like a ceramic or something silly like the first Moab because we're gonna be just like throwing so slowly. Like right now, look at this, look at this. We might have to use our ability, no way. I'm gonna use it, I'm gonna use it, okay. We got past that pink one, but now we're done on 16. So I think on my next tower will definitely be a sniper to kind of break down the crazy stuff that makes it around the track. And then maybe like a glue gunner will be perfect for something like this. But I'm gonna try to keep everybody in like a general area in case we need to village up later, get some camo. But we're gonna put this guy in strong and hope it helps. But look how slow he is, oh my goodness. He might as well just go back into the little arsenal on this side and not even help. We'll try full metal and then fast firing, even faster firing but oh my gosh the goal would be to get this guy to the ceramic killer so we can actually take down the moab on 40 but i don't know if we're gonna make it that far even look at this this is trash we're taking this long to beat these things oh no oh no oh no oh my god did you see that save i had him on strong and he wouldn't pop this one yellow so strong might not be the good play here i think we need to immediately get some glue on these strong ones this is getting rough so we'll go for, I guess, glue. I do not want to get glue this early on, but we'll do it. We got a glue. Get it? Okay. Now I'm thinking just, this will be just no damage, just straight glue. Oh, we have no camo. We have just Sada. Okay. She's actually fast enough to take it down. I think she gets speed increases as her level goes, which is great. And we'll get stronger glue on this guy. And should we put him on first or on strong to kind of slow everybody down? Actually, I'm not I'm not too upset right now, but I think 1945 is a little too much to be paying right now when we definitely need some more camo. Oh, you know who would be good? Wouldn't this guy not matter? Wouldn't his like, uh, what do you call virtual sub thingy, the nuke reactor be great, but then we still have nothing for the Moab. So I still think we should focus on getting large caliber, but no, 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 this isn't gonna work. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Can we knock them all out? Can we knock them all? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh my goodness, that was too close. Okay, we definitely need something else here that's gonna be good. What could it be? Like maybe a sub and then we'll get airburst starts at first or maybe attack at the end just to clean up everything that's kind of silly. <clears throat> that could be two. But if I get attacked this early, or sorry, a spike this early, that could be bad news bears pretty quickly. But it doesn't really care about attack speed. It just slow and sucks anyway. All right, we're gonna risk it. We're gonna get long range and smart spikes and try to keep all the spikes right here. And hopefully that'll just help like the little baby clean. Oh my God, he hasn't even put one out yet. He put one, one in that whole time. I think I still get my like minimum of five. Oh, oh, another good one. What about this guy right here with the wall of fire? That shouldn't have any problems. And our spikes actually getting some pops. He got nine pops or we'd have lost without him. We could have used Sada's, but you guys get the drift. Now, what do we do about camo? Okay, we have our spike and we have Sada. We have to hope that's enough. These purples are actually getting to me in my head right now but we have our wall of fire doesn't help for this round obviously oh and we're on chimps mode so we don't have the monkey knowledge that keeps the fire look how slow the fire is that was a bad play and we can't sell it for any money so it's just kind of a waste oh my goodness we'll just you know we got we did it we have to go with it now 
I think 36 is gonna be awful. I honestly don't know what we can do for, for 40. I don't because let's say like, I'm used to having Benjamin, right? Like let's say this guy actually does what he needs to do and he pops it down. Well, now we have a bunch of ceramics that are probably gonna break open in this area. And now we have to fight through them all, which is very dangerous. I don't even think about attack speed when I normally play this game. I'm just used to what I'm used to. So like that means this Druid of the Jungle won't attack as fast, right? So you're gonna have some big problems. And now look at this wizard not doing anything just literally out of commission for half of the round that's so dangerous okay i got my sniper i got what i wanted here but now my ideal ideally would be to have another 3780 by round 40 and then we would have our cleanup because those will be great ceramic cleaner uppers and then i think i'm gonna go for a sub because then we have all of our oh we were pretty bad on camo aren't we i just realized that we need some better camo here so we might have to get a sub Let's just play this one out and see. Oh, no, 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 no. We're actually not doing good. And then he put the first over there. That's not good either. Maybe that's okay. Okay, we got past this one, but now we don't have our ability. <laughs> okay, so what are we going to do here? Let's see what we got. Let's see if we can take this round out. We'll use Sada if we have to, because her ability doesn't really matter by the speed. He'll pop him open right now, hopefully. And then we'll just pop him out. Oh, yes. Okay, not bad. And now we need camo. So for that, we're going to go like this. This is a bad play, but we're going to do it. We're going to use this guy as our camo popper. But as you can see, we don't have enough to not die. <laughs> okay, pink ones, we can get through this. We can get through this. I just have to watch this bottom to make sure no like rainbows get through. Because as you can see, we're done. We're done. We're done. We got this. We got this though. We got this. Just come on. Do I? Oh, I have enough. I have enough. Look how slow that is. That is pitifully slow, but I think we can be okay. We'll speed him up a little bit to help. But as you can see, this thing is like, it's like watching the fan when you're laying in bed, staring up at the <laughs> ceiling fan. You're like, okay, I can see this thing go. It's so slow. And that's what I'm experiencing right now in real time. Okay. So now that we got that, I'm pretty happy. I think we're doing good. I'm going to go for a ring of fire. And then hopefully all these balloons can fall into the ring of fire. I just think it's crazy how the Bluntonium Reactor is actually affected. Like it's not just constantly going. It's pretty bad. It's it's pretty bad. It's doing its job and it's decamoing, but in the worst way possible. So that's kind of scary. But now that we have ring of fire, that's going to go. <laughs> it's a ring of fire sometimes. I think we're in a good spot, but I don't know what our next upgrade should be. I think we should get deadly spikes just to be safe and have a little bit of cleanup. Let's say like 55 or something. Because look at all these pink ones. They just ran through they ran through we're not in a good spot i mean we do have money so i should stop being crazy but my goodness okay we are we're gonna have to stomp those ones that's not okay now i'm thinking for our first fifth tier now hear me out i'm thinking maybe a mad i know it's a really pricey tower but on this map it should be okay but we need something a little sooner probably huh like even if for cheapest chimps you'd probably get up to like a attack zone pretty quickly and we have nothing for moabs right now like literally nothing i actually think we're gonna get our main moab this thing's just so indispensable to help us out a little bit more maybe oh, okay yeah that thing's great that thing's great i don't care how slow it is moabs are slow now even a middle path boat could be pretty awesome it attacks kind of slow, but with his recent buffs, it's pretty good regardless, I'm thinking. But a quarter speed is a lot to consider. I really like the Mad, and I think he's great on this tower. I'm going to go for it. We're going to lock him into place right here, because then we actually have a like a something to help us clean up if we need to, right? Like a last second thing, we could be like, oh no, and we can unlock him manually. Oh my god, we have to unlock him manually. Now, I'm hoping with all these visuals, if you can see, we do have Sada's little attack slashes on them. So they're getting hurt by her slashes, and they're getting hurt by his electricity. So we're doing a lot of like excess damage to these towers and i'm hoping that will help because as you know the next treacherous round 63 is upon us and i don't know if we can make it i know we have an ability for the first rush ability for the second but i always take these fortified moabs as my first test like can we beat it and we took those down pretty well so let's see what happens on 63 just we have the ring of fire which usually would be enough especially on this map is that good oh yeah that was actually really clean that's not bad i mean our wizard's a total joke but okay see now that one went a lot over our heads so i'm just going to use my second ability here rocket storm every 25 minutes apparently the, oh my god what did i get one push i got one wow 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 rocket storm thing that's crazy do i really think we can make it to sixty four thousand dollars with what we have here i have high hopes you know i'm i tend to be more positive with this game but that's a lie no i'm not i'm usually negative if i have to use the alchemist or any tower oh my goodness this is scary watch this rocket storm though one i get one two Three. Oh, okay. I got four. I think I got four. That's actually not the worst. That's what I would get normally. No, no, no. Normally you get a lot more because it attacks faster, which would make sense. But now all these ceramics, can we take them all? Yes. Okay. 
Dude, this spike is like, it's not the best, but as you can see, we lost a lot of them there and their elk buff. So I'm gonna give it props to this little deadly spike here. We might even last second have to get perma spike before we get our guy here, just because perma spike, I'm sorry, perma spike can solo the whole game, I swear. Not necessarily solo. You gotta get like an icicle and pale, maybe a glue gunner, but other than that, you're good. Now we do have the ability to lower our speed even more. We can no joke get this down to like, point half a percent so if you guys are enjoying this so far definitely hit that like button to let me know that you want to see us go even slower with these towers on a harder map and is that even possible we'll see how this one goes to find out because i'm not even sure we're going to make this yet because those ddt's are going to come zooming and we're going to go slowing through each of them oh no no we're getting there we're getting there no no okay how do you sada on 71 so we're already reaching our peak limit i don't know if these would have hung or on or not but i didn't want to test it now we do have other abilities here but i don't want to get heavy abilities used on 72 with only $18,000 when we need $64,000. That's never going to happen. I mean, we could give it a shot, but I think we're going to have to upgrade here. But even this is $32,000 and we're not there yet. And what do you guys think about the permit site? Because me personally, I hate getting it first because then you're completely relying on it and you're watching all of your other towers just struggle to stay alive. And then you're like, come on. And you're clinching every time they make it to the end of the track. At this point, I think anything will help. And 75 is like one of my least favorite rounds. We're gonna actually get this guy to bigger radius and jungle drums. And I'm not sure what the speed buff is on a jungle drums, but considering that we're already quarter speed, can we at least get up to like half speed with this jungle drums? That would be great just to help out a little bit because 75 is awful. But I think I'm going to use my ability here, get that first one going because this is going to be tough. We're going to use our rocket storm too, and we should be able to clear all these out. And then last case scenario, we have Sada can go like this once they're all popped down, which they are. We'll use Sada. There we go. Get that one. Perfect timing. Go Sada. You're the best. You're the best. Well, after bin. You're the best after bin, but you're pretty good. Oh, no, 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 no. We're going to be bad on this one. We're going to be bad. It's a regrowth farm. It's a regrowth farm. We can't beat it. We can't beat it. How are we going to beat this? Like maybe ability a little sooner. So ability first, but we can't, right? No, don't tell me we made it this far just to lose. Oh, Rico blocker. We go blocker. We should have done that at first. This is getting too overwhelming for my little towers here. This is getting too much. They're not enough. And I don't know what to do because I just realized like we're going after the slowest tower in the game. Like the mad is so slow. I was just hoping that since he has two like shocker punches, he can go like one, two, three, four, and they'll be slower. Yes, but they'll still pack that punch. But we're not even halfway there and we're going after a slow tower. It just seems kind of silly at this point. All right, we need to buy something. We can't We can't go on like this. This is too much. You know, we could buy the permit. No, we could. Oh my God, we almost died again. We're going to die right now. No, we're not. I think we should buy permit spike. I really do. I think that should just be our tower for a little bit here. And then, yeah, oh, I don't want to do it. I, that's cheating. Cheating if you get permit spike this early. You're just a big lame because it's too good. But I'm so bad. We have this guy. This will regenerate. So we'll just use it once. Get some attacks on there. I think we can take this one. It's just one ZOMG like... Lamo, we can do it. I don't know if we can be able to beat this. There's too many Moabs. If our ability comes back, we'll be okay. Juan Sa, don't let me down. This is your chance to shine. You're the girl. You're the girl. You got this. Now, what I'm thinking is let's say we do get this guy. It's the balloons that are giving us the troubles, not the Moabs. I mean, they're all giving us troubles, but the Moabs are less than, well, and then this round comes out and it just looks overwhelming. So I'm thinking, what if we went with something like this guy whose speed doesn't really matter? If we got him, I think we'd be okay, but then watch him be like super slow. I think he should be fine though. So like place him right here in range of the village and everything, if we can, or I guess not. Right there, I guess we're gonna do it. Oh, we died in time. I really don't want this guy right here. Like I really don't, but I mean, where else am I supposed to put him? Can he fit in here? No, right? I didn't go well enough on that. And we have a dart monkey over here. Okay, I'm gonna take a gamble. I'm gonna take a fat gamble here. We're gonna do it and not even have enough. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Jesus, <laughs> watch us die before. Okay, there we go. We'll grab this one and red hot rings. Now we should be clean. Oh, thank you for being so good. Thank you. We'll get you some primary training just to juice you up even more. Like that's a weird spot to be in, but I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> but you know what though? <laughs> Firma Spike would have still probably been a better choice. Now I think we're reaching the end of our powers here. Oh my gosh, we are, we are, we are. Sada has to take care of these ceramics. What am I paying this guy for? He's 198,000 pops, but then Sada has 180 and he has 142. So he's not even that good. I think I definitely need my Perma Spike, but of course we're short. You're always short. <laughs> I don't know if we're gonna make it through this one. Oh my gosh, I can use my ability, but that's it. Come on. Boomer, 
Oh my gosh. Oh no. Rocket Storm. Rocket Storm. Come on. Come on. Dude, that was clutchy. Oh my gosh. Is that how you say that word? Clutchy? But now we're broke and we have to fight DDT. So we have not even... We need Fervus Spike. Come on, come on. Okay, that's all the... That was all the sniper. 100% the sniper that just saved our butts right there. So now we have to come up with something else. I'm not sure if Ice Shards is helping, but something is. So I'm like, should I get Embrittlement too? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh, we did it. We did it. We did it. But now we have 95. But 95 is easy because DDT sucks. So as long as we have something to get through them. But look at He's not even out. Oh, because he's slower too. He's not even using his acidic mixture dip on him. That could be really bad. That could end us right now if this doesn't work out. But I'm going to use my rocket storm here. Maybe we can break him down a little bit. He's going to walk right through, isn't he? Yep, I knew it. He didn't have any acidic mixture dip. Oh no, that totally kills this whole this whole plan. Ninja Kiwi, if you're watching this, you made it to where we can uh, we can use his first upgrade path to pick where he puts his fire. Please, 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 please please allow us to pick where the alchemist goes because the alchemist is terrible it's like a child you tell him one thing he does the other every single time it's so god awful let's fix that i just truly I, i'm trying not to get upset but i truly look at this thing and it's it's on that tower there's no other place it should go it's supposed to take priority and it's literally like yeah let's give acidic mixture dip to a tower that doesn't need it just no now we cannot beat it because of that reason just right there here we are back on the dreaded round 95 and I've completely overhauled this. It's taken about an hour and a half, almost two hours now to redo this a few times. I have double discount villages. So this guy is totally ready to see lead camo, the whole nine yards. Same with this guy up here and he's alchemist buffed. He is super strong, but it's so slow that it doesn't really matter. It's the scary part about it. So we can probably take out this round. Hopefully at least every single spike will actually pop at this time. No run throughs or silly stuff. It'll actually do it just a matter of if we have enough life for it so i am going to use sada's ability again kind of like take some of it down for us because it might be too much no okay ddts are so weak that's awesome but i just don't know i guess i'm not knowledgeable enough i don't know what is the best like ceramic popper because none of these are they're all terrible so i think we should use our ability now and then use it again once it regenerates right it's just those are so fast so fast still and we'll use this as soon as it gets here again so blap and we'll use our second ability because we can't take all those ceramics. Clean up some of these ones. There we go. We have no abilities and a lot of super ceramics right now. It's working though. If we can just get these ones back. No, no, no. That second ability. There's just too many mobs. Too many mobs. Maybe, maybe, maybe. No. Oh my gosh. I got rid of all the fortifieds. This might actually work. This might actually work. Oh my gosh. This is like my 35th try. Don't die. Just use the ability. Use the ability. Slow it down. Oh my gosh. We did it. We did it. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, this is getting too much too intense. Oh yes, freeze them forever because then we can get our abilities back and we can get some more spikes. This is working out perfectly. Oh my god, it's meant to be. We gotta move this guy to strong so we can get those DDTs. We'll slow him down. We did it. We did it. We're on round 100. Okay, now we just gotta go for it. Go ham. Get maybe a sniper to help out with the popping. There we go. Just keep using abilities. We might actually beat this. Oh my god. I was I'm at my wits in on this one. I'm stressed. Okay, we didn't break it open, but we have the snipers, we have our abilities, and then we can slow it down as soon as it breaks open, even if it's in front of this thing. Oh, but we have a ZOMG. There we go. We can slow down the ZOMG when it gets in range here. I think we can actually do this. I think we can. We'll slow it down now that it's in range. We'll use our first ability, get those down to Moabs, get those down to the Soda, Soda, Soda. That was like two and a half hours. And if you want to see even more crazy Bloom CD6 content, check out this video where we mod in the sword monkey into Bloom CD6. If you thought Sada was awesome, check out this tower.